Hey guys, what is going on? Today we're going to be reviewing set 75276, which is the Stormtrooper and is recommended for ages 18 plus and contains 647 pieces. They, they included the piece count on the boxes of this for some reason, but I'm not sure why they don't include it on everything, but it doesn't matter. So on the box we've got the nice Empire logo and Stormtrooper written underneath that and Star Wars below that. Then we've got a picture of the build, Star Wars logo, Lego logo down there, the piece count, age and the set number. So on this side we've got another picture of the um, Stormtrooper and it says Helmet Collection and also the 40 Empire Strikes Back logo thing. Which is pretty cool. Um, and up the top we've got a one-to-one -one scale of a piece, just a three by one with a slope. And yeah, and another picture of that Stormtrooper and that Empire logo. So now let's have a look at what the actual product looks like. And my opinion on it. The box is quite hefty size as well. Just gotta point that out. And here is the finished product. So as you can see, we have um, the Stormtrooper. <laughs> it's got this sort of sloping, thick um, bottom of the helmet feel to it. So it looks quite good. Obviously, this is just a display model. It doesn't have any features as it's recommended for ages 18 and up. So there's nothing you can do with it except look at it and have it look nice. I think it looks really good compared to like um, the TIE Fighter Pilot one because that one seems a bit flat on the sides but that's just my opinion. This is really well rounded and looks pretty good. The only thing that I think that LEGO could have improved on with this specific set is using printed pieces instead of stickers there because stickers are a bit of a pain <laughs> obviously with any set and yeah. So. There are also stickers along here that would have been nice printed as well. There's four on that side and four on the other side. So it would have been nice if those were printed, but we get what we get. And I'm pretty happy with it. It's really nice and detailed. There's a lot of detail being put into it. Like they probably got a life-size model of the helmet and did it off that. And the top is really nice. It looks sort of flat, but... Maybe they could have built a bit up, bit more up, but that's just my opinion. And yeah, overall I would really recommend this set, especially because of that nice printed piece, Lego Star Wars 2020, uh, Stormtrooper, sorry, thinking of the promo one, <laughs> but that's pretty nice, and yeah, it's a great display model, and I would highly recommend it, if you like Star Wars and Lego. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next review.